Hey everyone, Nut Free Mama here. Today I'm going to show you how to make Cookie Monster Sandwich Cookies. Okay, these cookies are a type of cake cookie. I just really love making the cookies out of the cake mixes. They just taste so good. So you're going to need one box of cake mix. If you can find blue, that's great. Um, so I have white and I'm going to use the blue food coloring to make it look like Cookie Monster. Then you need two eggs, a half a cup of vegetable oil, some white frosting that we're going to pipe in between the two cookies to make it um, his mouth. And then you need um, mini chocolate chip cookies. I'm just going to use those Chips Ahoy minis. And then, of course, some candy eyes. And that's it. It's a really easy recipe and it's going to be so cute. So let's go ahead and preheat our oven to 350 and get our electric mixer ready in a big bowl and line a cookie sheet with parchment paper. All right, so let's go ahead and mix our cake mix, two eggs, oil, and our um, food coloring with an electric mixer until it's nice and combined. This is going to be very sticky dough, and it is going to be really hard to mix um, towards the end. All right, our dough is all nice and combined, so next you just want to go ahead and chill that in the refrigerator for about 10 to 15 minutes, just so it's easier to work with. Okay, after your dough has chilled for about 10 to 15 minutes, go ahead and remove it. From the refrigerator and take out tablespoon sized little um drops and roll those into balls um and then we're going to go ahead and put those in the oven for eight to ten minutes there's no need to um flatten them or anything like that they will do that all on their own all right my first batch has just come out of the oven don't worry if they're still a little um gooey looking they will um continue to bake as they're sitting on the cooling rack you do not want to burn them because the bottoms will just turn a brown color and you don't want that to ruin your little cookie monster. So I have my other batch in the oven and then we are just going to let these cool and then we'll work on the frosting. My other batch is still in the oven. I went ahead and added my eyes into the top of some of my cookies just so that way as they're setting up maybe the eyes um, will stay in there a little better. But you can see I just kind of smushed them in. Cookie Monster's eyes are kind of close together, so I try to get them as close as possible. But they look really cute. Okay, all of my cookies are out of the oven and cooled off, and my little eyes are on top of half of them. And I went ahead and put my white frosting into a Ziploc bag, and I'm going to cut the tip off. And we're just going to go ahead and pipe it onto the bottom of one cookie and sandwich them together. All right, my cookies are all sandwiched together. And what I did was just put um, more of the frosting in the front part and then kind of sandwiched them like this. And then you just shove a little cookie in his mouth and he's munching on it and he looks so adorable. So let's just finish these up. All right, these are all ready to go and they look so cute. I can't wait for Taste Tester to have a little taste. All right, Taste Tester's here. So let's see what he thinks. Taste tester. Have a little taste. Oh my gosh. Mmm. -hmm. Yum, yum. Do you like it? Yeah. All right, everyone. Come back and see us again. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye. Bye.